Good afternoon, everyone. Happy new release day on a fr and happy Friday as well. 2017 Bow Crow, Bowman Chrome Baseball, uh, 12 box, pick your team number one from jazbeeshobbyland.com. Remember, on the website, um, on the main channel website, jazbeeshobbyland.com, we are doing HTA choice, which is 12 boxes, all autographs, right? Just three autographs per box. On eBay, we have 12 box hobby edition. Stores.ebay.com slash jazbeeshobbyland has 12 box hobby editions, which, which include everything else. So if you go to cardboardconnection.com, you'll be able to see the checklist right here. So for hobby, you'll get autographs plus uh, various parallels and inserts. For us, on jazbeeshobbyland.com only, the HTA choice breaks are one box, uh, one pack per box, three autographs per box. So I hope that makes sense. And I hope uh, we added that in the description too, so hopefully we'll s you notice the distinction. All right, so big thanks to these folks right here for getting into this new release today. First case of the day. Good luck, everybody. Joe Cavanaugh with that last bot mojo, Royals. Time to get new toner. I think we've stretched that toner as far as it could go. All right. So let's pick your team one. There it is. So this case is significantly smaller than the hobby case. And I think the 10 buck break site, which Jason is doing Monday through Friday, has um, has hobby boxes. They're doing one box random team breaks. So if you're interested in that, check out our brand new website, 10 buck breaks. Dot com. For everything else, we've got another case of this, the HTA, uh, with only like three or four teams left. So we can do another one pretty much right after this. Jaspyshobbyland.com. Good luck, everybody. Oh, let's take a closer look at the box first. I, for new releases, I like taking my time a little bit on the first uh, the first box or the first break. Just see what we got going on. I've got Clint Frazier, Cody Bellinger on the front. You know, three uh, autographs per box. May include some redemptions. There we go, looking for parallels, exclusive refractors. There's my boy Cody Bellinger. There's all the other info. There are your approximate odds. There you go. So, oh, it's in this little pack right here. Oh, I see, they're in those little plastic cases. Which is nice, good luck everybody. Right. Uh, how should we do this? How about we do it this way? First one is, oh, there you go. Moss 188. He wants to make a rainbow of this guy. Tory Hunter Jr. on card autograph. Purple. That's a good start for Bruce. Nice. And that is 66 out of 250. There you go. Uh, yeah, great autograph, right? ESPN kid, Ryan's like, what a great autograph. Yeah, nice autograph. Bruce was telling me earlier that um, announces end to his, his Notre Dame football career. Concussion issues, I think, and then committed, uh, committed to baseball. So there you go. Obviously, Bowman Chrome, prospect heavy. We've got, wow, nice. Gold Wave, Anderson Tejeda. That is 14 out of 50. Nice one for the Rangers. That will go to uh, Diane with the Rangers. Right, Tory Hunter Jr. must not text, says Paul T, because he has good penmanship. So pretty standard design, pretty classic Bowman Chrome design, which I always like. I always like the info on the back. Learn a lot about the new players. Oh, comes from the same hometown as Miguel Tejada and Eric Ibar. Nice. So nice one, Diane and the Rangers. And next one here is... Nice. Jorge Ona. Nice on-card auto for the San Diego Padres. That goes to Mike Kuntz. Padres have a lot of young players uh, coming up the pipeline. There you go. That was box number one. So we'll, we'll save these for, I guess, for playbook when playbook comes out. 
triple threads has books too. We can use that. We do have triple threads baseball on the site, folks. Top triple threads baseball. Jaspisabiland.com. If you want to chase legends and other stuff like that. All right. And looks like another Tory Hunter Jr. Bruce, we might make the rainbow in this case right here. Refractor Auto for Bruce. That's Moss 188. And the Los Angeles, California Angels of Anaheim in Orange County. So 186 out of 499. We've got for my Dodgers, Mitchell White. Standard auto there. I don't know much about Mitchell White, Dodgers, Stephen Cook. I know Verdugo autos are in here, so that, that's going to be one of the big ones you're chasing. Bellinger, too. But, all right. Oh, second rounder. Got it. Pitcher. Dodgers got a lot of those. Number 12 prospect. All right, fair enough. Nice K per nine. And we've got for the Twins, Luis... Uh, Areas, Luis Areas, uh, Anthony Alvarez with the Twins. Not numbered, nice look there, second baseman, number 28 Twins prospect. There you go. Next one. We've got Twins, Gold, Griffin Jacks. Nice Griffin Jacks. That's 43 out of 50 on that one, Twins. That will be for Anthony. There you go. Number three, Twins Prospect, according to MLB.com. They need that pitch. Twins need that pitching. For the Giants, we have... Nice. Look at that. Miguel Gomez. I like the design of the background. Giants. Greg Dunaway with that one. There you go, Greg. And that is 88 out of 150. Two-time uh, minorleaguebaseball.com organization all-star choice. Not bad. Not bad. Third baseman. Someone needs to replace the panda. Right, what are what are those called? I know Panini calls them one thing, but is there something that blue? Not sure what they call it. <laughs> Trying to look at the parallels right now. I think it's just blue. I think that's just blue, out of one fifty. What's this card number? CPAMG. Oh, they call it Blue Mojo. All right. They're using the same vocabulary. Yeah, that's what I thought that was called, but I didn't know if they wanted to call it something different. But all right, ah, for the Royals, there you go, last spot mojo. That's uh, I, I gotta practice his name in case he makes it to the big leagues. My Breeze Veloria, My Breeze Veloria, My Breeze Veloria. Nice one for Joe Cavanaugh, last spot mojo, number fifteen Royals prospect. So apparently, great catcher, strong arm defender, good hitter as well. Maybe, maybe future Salvador Perez in the pipeline for the Royals. All right. Next box. So these are all on-card autos. There are some redemptions in here. I kind of like that they put them in these little uh, slider boxes here, and they 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 have that. They have the um, that little slip of paper that's in between each card. Uh, the, the Bowman Bowman obviously focuses a little more heavily on prospects and rookies, and these off, oftentimes these are their first autographs or their first cards. So if any one of these guys become big, it becomes it, like these cards become super special, you know. So I think 
they recognize that they recognize the demands of the uh, of the collector, like you guys, and they're protecting these as well as possible, which I think is awesome. Uh, nice Under Armour All American Baseball, Dylan Cease. That's one eighty five out of one ninety nine. Where do you go, Dylan? I don't think he's. I think he might still be high school prospect. So this will be randomized to uh, to one person in the break. Yeah, high school. That's what I thought. High school, national high school invitational. So this will be randomized to someone in the break. Our first redemption. Let's skip the redemption. Let's go with this first. Carson Kelly, nice. 68 out of 150. So Arizona Fall League. Insert, auto. So I guess those, those look like they're going to be stickers. At least this one is. 68 out of 150. There you go. Nice one for CJ and the Cardinals. Yeah, Car a lot of people talking about Carson Kelly. We've got one for the Indians. Nice. So on-card auto for the Tribe. That'll be for Darren McKenzie. That's Andrew Kalika. Not numbered, but the number 29 Cleveland prospect, according to MLB.com. There you go. And the redemption is you are due to receive Bowman Chrome Prospect Purple Refractor Parallel of Andy Abanez. Andy Abanez is a Texas Ranger and Purple is out of 250. Nice one for the Rangers. That'll be for Diane. Yeah, I think we got a bonus one here, right, David? Awesome, nice one for the Rangers. Next box. We got Logan Ice, Blue Mojo, an on-card autograph. Is his last name really Ice? That's awesome. I'll I'll bet it's like, I hope it's not like Ise or something like that. <laughs> I'm gonna go with Ice. I'm gonna go with Ice. That Blue Mojo is out of 150, 45 out of 150 for the uh, number 22 Indians prospect. Tribe that goes to Darren. Next one is this is a nice one for the Yankees, Clint Frazier. Clint Frazier for the Bronx Bombers. That goes to Mary Lou in the Yankees. Didn't they trade Clint Frazier? Or am I thinking of Gliber Torres? I don't know, Clint Frazier's still a Yankee. I think maybe it was Gliber Torres that they traded. But there you go, Mary Lou. One of their top prospects. Came from the uh, Indians organization, if I remember correctly. And then for the Rangers, we got Leone Tavares. Another one for the Rangers. That'll go to Diane. Diane with the Rangers. And there you go. Yep, one of their top prospects. I think we've we've seen him in the action, right? In some of the action. This season, if I remember correctly. Oh, is Torres still with the Yankees too? Then who am I thinking of? Who did they who they, who'd they move for Sonny Gray, JC? I guess that's what I'm wondering. Yeah, they got Clint Frazier in the Andrew Miller deal, right? Oh, Brian's saying Cease was traded to the Sox in the Quintana move? Wait, so is he associated with a... 
I suppose I should take a look. Oh, actually, yeah, Dylan C. Oh, it was Blake Rutherford in that grade, in the Sunday grade trade. Oh, I'm sorry. Yeah, I apologize. The uh, Dylan Cease is, um, yeah, he'll go to the White Sox. Because we'll, we'll kind of use our non-pro uniform rules. Sorry, I should have explained this early. I didn't think we were going to run into this. Um, so for the Under Armour All-America All Stuff right here, 185 out of 199. Um, if you, most of you are, should be familiar with our college rules, where if they're in their college or not, basically a non-pro uniform, it'll go to the team they are currently on. So we'll send this to the White Sox because that's where he is currently. So that'll go to Brian Sawyer. There you go, Brian. Good research. So I'll post a note that you're good to go, Brian. White Sox for that Under Armour All America one. So we'll use our college rules for that for uh, future reference. All right, next one is we've got another Anderson Tejeda purple for the Rangers and Diane. Out of two fifty, their top ten prospects there. Next one here is another Clint Frazier. Refractor auto. Nice one, Mary Lou. Mary Lou with the Yankees. And she gets the refractor auto. Another Clint Frazier. 428 out of 499. Then we've got for the Rockies, Brian Mundell. Kip, Kip, hooray with the rocks. There you go, Kip. Oh, JC is saying, oh, he's saying it was Capralian, Jorge Mateo, and Fowler to the A's for Sonny Gray. I always get confused. I feel like that deal, was that like a, was that a, that was a deadline deal, right? Forget all the all those tr the waiver and non waiver trade deadline moves and all that sort of stuff. You know, it all gets jumbled up in my head at this point. Clint Frazier on the uh, on the Yankees should be pretty interesting. Um, a lot of people were talking in in Cleveland about how how big of a deal that was to move Clint Frazier. So if you know that you know, if you know the fans are sad about it, like, and you know that he was he was a great prospect, um, Max Schrock for the Oakland A's refractor autograph for John Fernandez, nice. Four fifty five out of four ninety nine, top sixteen prospect for the Oakland A's. Oakland A's always have a bunch of prospects coming up the ranks. We've got Gage Hines. Gage Hines, on-card auto for the Pirates. Jeff Goldberg with Gage. There you go. Top 17 prospect, according to Baseball America. There you go. They have some nice pitchers coming up the ranks. We've got Ryan Howard. No, not that Ryan Howard. This Ryan Howard. For the San Francisco Baseball Giants, that'll go to Greg. Greg with the Giants, a little opposite Joe Mojo, the Dodgers guy. There you are, shortstop. Nice, a little bit of speed too. There you go. Next box. So pretty solid stuff so far, and I, I I do enjoy learning about learning about these prospects. I think that's that's part of the fun about baseball. I think there there is like a fun game to play in terms of like these like these long term investments, you know, because you'll be like, well, I mean, this guy's gonna be playing, Leody Ter uh, Tavares. That's a blue parallel for Diane and the Rangers. Rangers doing well in this break. There you go, that's out of 150, 121 out of 150. 
More Angels. Blue Mojo. David Fletcher. For uh, for Moss. For Bruce. Moss, 188. 35 out of 150. Angels need to retool that farm system. We got Adrian Morajon for the Padres. Mike Koontz with the Friars. There you are, signed at 17. There you go. That's it for this box. We got four more to go. Good luck, everybody. So remember, we are. This is a the brand new 2017 Bowman Chrome Baseball. This is HTA edition. So it's 12 boxes, and there's three autographs per box in the HTA edition, which is on our website, jazbeeshobbyland.com. On our sister channel, tenbugbreaks.com, you'll see hobby editions, which will include more uh, base cards and inserts and whatnot. One fewer autograph, though. Uh, nice. Amir Garrett. Nice rookie auto. Amir Garrett for the Reds. Uh, Jeremy Merle with the Red Legs. That's a nice one. That's uh, the Refractor Auto, 87 out of 499. Yep, top three prospect for the Reds. More Yankees. We've got Albert Abreu. On-card autograph for Mary Lou and the Yankees. Number 11, Yankees prospect. The King 77 asking, uh, who are the big hits? Well, the big big names like, uh, um, like Cody Bellinger are in this set. But a lot of these are, are, um, are prospects. So that's kind of what you're, uh, you're banking on right here. Ovelki Peralta. There may be some of the higher draft picks that'll that'll resell pretty well immediately, but a lot of these, you're just kind of holding on to these, seeing what happens to them. Number eighteen, Baltimore prospect, right here. But these these Bowman cards are among the most popular once like someone hits it big. Like I think, like I want to say like Reese Hoskins has like an old Bowman Chrome auto or something like that from back in the day, uh, or a card or something like that, and now they're now they're going, um, you know, now they're going nuts <laughs> trying to find all that. JT asking what hit on Spectra 5? I don't remember Spectra 5. <laughs> that was like two weeks ago, I think. We have the videos up, Jeremy Tillman. You can watch those. All right, next one is... Blue Mojo autograph, Jose Trevino. That goes to the Rangers. That'll be for Diane. The Rangers doing well in this break. 008 out of 150. Nice. Next is another Max Schrock. Max Schrock autograph for the Oakland A's. That'll be for John Fernandez. There you go, number 16 prospect in the South Atlantic League, according to Baseball America. A little more opposite Joe Mojo. Heath Quinn on card auto for the Giants and Greg. Oh, Reese was an extra edition with autos, right? I knew it was like, there weren't very many of Reese Hoskins, but I'm sure we'll see a lot of him next year. There you go, number seven, Giants prospect. Either way, these Bowman Chrome cards, I mean, hence the, uh, hence the uh, fancy packaging right here. That's why they take so much care with these. Though <laughs> the king, your computer froze. You missed the whole thing. I was talking for like two minutes on this. 
You just have to watch the video. Cody Bellinger, Alex Bregman, but and then and then a bunch of future stars. All right, we got what is this? Nice prime chrome signature, sixty-four out of seventy-five. Lourdes Gurriel Jr. with an inscription. I don't know what that inscription says, but there it is. And that is for the Blue Jays. Is he is he Ulysses Yuli's brother or is he not? I I thought I heard something where he was, but maybe maybe I was just thinking of that in my head. Um, Daniel Pelletier with the Blue Jays, nice hit. We've got one for the Mariners, Braden Bishop. King D says he is okay. That's what I thought. King D, Astros guy. He's he's in Houston. Mariners, Alexander Lom with that one. Number 16 Mariners prospect. Then we've got more Torrey Hunter Jr. for Bruce. He wants to make the rainbow. Did I just have to find you a like a super fractor now, Bruce? And we'll be, you'll be well on your way. So this is the uh, the base autograph, Torrey Hunter Jr. And the last box, ladies and gentlemen, this is Picker Team number one. 12 boxes, all autos. This is the HTA Choice Edition. The other editions are in the eBay store. Stores.ebay.com slash Jaspies Hobbyland. If you want to do more of this, jazbeeshobbyland.com. I think pretty much all of these breaks, well, I think the next one is, well, it's only like three or four teams away. And then the one after that was like pretty much a team or two away from single digits. So we should be able to do multiples of these tonight. There's a redemption. Then we've got for the Rockies, Jeff Hoffman, rookie auto. He's looked pretty solid this season. I think Jeff Hoffman was a former uh, Blue Jays prospect. I think he came from the Tulo trade maybe. Oh, that's what it says right there. The Tulo trade. And a dog lover. There you go. And enjoy spending time in the pool. Maybe long walks on the beach as well for Jeff Hoffman. All right, nice one, Rockies. Uh, that heads out to Kip Kip Hooray for the Mets. We got Tomas Nito autograph. That will be for Armando and the Mets. There we are. Future catcher, perhaps, top 10 prospect, according to Baseball America. And the redemption is Nick Banks, Bowman Chrome Prospect Auto, Nick Banks. Where do you go, Nick Banks? Nick Banks is a national. So there you go, Ryan Redman with the Nats. So the Nationals with that one. And there you have it, ladies and gentlemen. That was Pick Your Team number one of 2017 Bowman Chrome Baseball. Brand new release today. I'm sure we'll do plenty more today. So check it out, jazbeeshobbyland.com. This is Joe. We'll see you next time.